guidance as of now. Hello, Leo. I think you may have some technical um, issues with your audio. It does not sound good. So, un poquito extraño tu audio, Leo. Si lo puedes checar por allá. Bueno, no un poquito, mucho extraño. That sounds better. Mejor. Good morning, Eric. Despertando. Hello, teacher. <laughs> Hello. Good morning, teacher. Morning, morning. Please, everyone, have your cameras turned on. Let's begin. First, with the attendance role, and afterwards, we go with the um with the class. Teacher, I'm marcar tarea de casa. Yes, mucha tarea de casa. Desde el primer año no tienen tarea. Ustedes tienen toda la tarea del mundo. ¿Y saben por qué? Porque estuve checando los, los, las tareas y no me enviaron muchas tareas. Recuerden que ustedes tienen clase martes y jueves. O sea que después de la clase del martes hacen su tarea para que el, el miércoles ya sea. Yes. Good. Yes, sure. Good. So let's begin. Let's go with the attendance role. You know how it works. I call your name and then you say here and please wave your hand to the camera so I can see it, right? My dad, please turn your camera on. Same as you, Alex. Is Erika Isabella? <clears throat> here. Amina? Here. Naomi Salome? Here. Argentina? Here. Evelyn, Elena? Sofía, Victoria. Maite, Alejandra. Maite. Yeah. Yeah. Maite, can you turn your camera on? Puedes encender tu cámara. Same with you, Alex. Thank you, Alex. Um, María Esperanza. Brittany Mayrin. Esta compañera Brittany se une a sus clases de las demás asignaturas? Ok. No, casi no. Ok, thank you. Se la comieron. Godzilla. Aranza Marisol. 
<ríe> que se ríen. <ríe> Isaí, Alejandro. Yeah. Gustavo, Adrián. Gustavo. El tiche, pero es que es no, que es Edric. David Hernández. Eric Valentino. Teacher. Ángel Leonel. Sí. Brian Moisés. ¿Él no se conecta tampoco? A él se lo comió King Kong. No, <laughs> Mark, ok, José Alexander. Marco Alejandro. También se lo comieron. ¿Y a este quién se lo comió? Cristóbal. Ok, good. También. Oh. Yeah. Let's begin. Repeat English. English, English, English. English, English. 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 Do you remember the information about Oyuki? ¿Se acuerdan de la información de Oyuki, Roberto, Jared, and Sophie? Yes. 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 Yeah. Yes. Good. Let's listen. Let's practice and remember repeating sentences about the actions in the present. But first, let's begin. Y ahora? Ahora se ve en blanco la hoja. That's good. Se ve, se ve en blanco, pero yo lo veo que no la raya en medio. Todavía veo la raya en medio. Okay, repeat actions in the present. Actions in the present. In the present. Actions in the present. Actions in the present. Actions in the present. Repeat. Actions in the present. Okay, for example, um, Romina works in Walmart. Repeat. Romina works in Walmart. She has a red car. Repeat. She, she has a red car. She likes to eat. ¿Qué te gusta comer, Romina? To eat. Mm, no sé. She likes to eat. No sé. Wow. <laughs> she likes to eat panuchos. Repeat. She likes to eat Good. So repeat actions in the present. Actions in the present. Romina works in Walmart. Romina works in Walmart. She has a red car. She likes to eat panuchos. Like yeah. Now let's go with the following part. Vamos a... Yes. Tenemos que copiar esto. Mm, después. Después. Más a... Habrá tiempo después. Okay. So now let's talk about actions in the present. Listen, observe, and repeat. Tienen que mirar. Lo que apunto, tienen que escuchar lo que digo y repetirlo, pero traten de entenderlo. ¿Qué es lo que estamos diciendo? Repeat. This is Oyuki. This is Oyuki. She lives in Japan. She lives in Japan. 
Japan. She lives in Japan. She studies medicine. She studies medicine. She wants to be a doctor. She wants to be a doctor. She likes to read the newspaper. She has a small family. She has a small family. She speaks French, English, and Japanese. She speaks English. Listen and repeat. She speaks French, English, and Japanese. She, she speaks French, English, and Chinese. Not Chinese. No, no, not Chinese. She speaks French, English, and Japanese. She speaks French, French, and Japanese. This is Roberto. This is Roberto. He lives in Rome. She lives in Rome. He has a big family. He likes to play soccer. He wants to be an actor. He wants to be an actor. He works in a restaurant. He works in a restaurant. They are Gerard and Sophie. They are. They, they have a small family. They have a small family. They work in a hospital. They work in a hospital. They like to eat chicken. They study English. They study English. They study English. They live in Paris. They live in Paris. Good. Okay, now let's practice comprehension. Let's do one activity. But before, do you remember the information about Oyuki, Roberto, and Jaron and Sophie? Vamos a hacer una actividad de comprensión, pero antes, Alexander y Maite, cámaras encendidas en todo momento, por favor. Es la última vez que les pido. Sí, la iba prendiendo, está arreglando algo de la cámara. Sí, la iba prendiendo, está arreglando algo de la cámara. El ángulo. Good, thank you. Necesito verlas. Maite, posiciona tu cámara para que pueda poner tu rostro completo. Necesito ver que articulas. Igual ayer te comenté. Que sea la última vez, chicos, que les estoy llamando la atención acerca de cámaras y micrófonos. Si no, voy a tener que llamar a sus papás uno por uno para comunicarles la situación. Thank you. Good. So, do you remember the information about Oyuki, Roberto, and Gerard and Sophie? ¿Se acuerdan de Roberto, Oyuki, y Gerard and Sophie? Yes or no? Yes. Or yeah. less. Yes. Yeah. Okay, good. Now, let's do something real quick. I say one sentence about the person, and you tell me who that person is. I mean, you need to come up with a complete sentence by adding the subject. Voy a decir la mitad de una oración. Y ustedes tienen que pensar quién hace esta acción. Por ejemplo, si es Oyuki, o she, si es Roberto, o he, o si es Gerald and Sophie, 
day. Entonces, el juego es muy sencillo. Yo digo la parte final de la información, ustedes tienen que identificar quién es el que lo está haciendo, ¿ok? Por ejemplo, si yo digo, lives in Japan. Oyuki. Pero tienen que decir completo, Oyuki lives in Japan. Repeat. For example, if I say, if I say, has a big family. Roberto Roberto has a big family. Everyone repeat, Roberto has a big family. Okay, good. Is it clear? Claro. Teacher, ¿podría pasar al baño? Por favor. Yes, Alexander. ¿Quedó claro? Uh, yes. Good. Let's do it first in groups and then let's do it individual. Lo vamos a hacerlo primero en grupo y luego individualmente. Okay, so first I say studies medicine. The students medicine. Oyuki studies medicine. They, they or Oyuki? Oyuki. 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 Oyuki studies medicine. Repeat. Oyuki studies medicine. Ok, no estoy escuchando a Naomi, ni a Esperanza, ni a nadie. Ok, prendan su micrófono, repiten y lo van a apagar. Oyuki. The student a medicine. Oyuki studies medicine. Recuerden que importante es. Oyuki studies medicine. Repeat. Oyuki That is correct. Next one. Um, next one. I say, live in Paris. Live in Paris. They. They live in Paris. 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 Okay, let's go with um, work. Work in the hospital. They work in the hospital. They work. They work in the hospital. They work in the hospital. They work in a hospital. Good. Work in a restaurant. Roberto works in a restaurant. Roberto works in a restaurant. Okay, good. So now let's read the story one more time and then we analyze the structure. Ahora que tenemos un poco en mente. read the text one more time and then we go with the structure. Vamos a leer el texto y luego vamos con la... Sure. Se ve la raya, yes. no se ve el texto. Allá. Okay. So, please listen and repeat. My friends. My friends. My friends. My friends. This is Oyuki. This is Oyuki. This is Oyuki. She lives in Tokyo. She lives in Tokyo. She has two brothers. Two brothers. Brother. Sister. Sister. Oyuki speaks English, French, and of course Japanese. Oyuki speaks English, French, and of course Japanese. 
She studies medicine at the University of Tokyo. She wants to be a doctor. She wants, she wants to be a doctor. doctor. Oyuki likes to read newspapers and magazines. Oyuki likes to read newspapers and magazines. She reads the Asahi Shimbun every day. She reads the Asahi every day. Every day. Because she likes to know about events in Japan. Because she likes to know about events in Japan. This is Roberto. This is Roberto. He lives in Rome. He lives in Rome. He has a big family. Four brothers and three sisters. He has a big family for Robert and three sisters. Three sisters. Roberto speaks Italian and Spanish. Roberto speaks Italian and Spanish. Bien, bien, cuiden las esas. He studies drama in the morning because he wants to be an actor. He works at a restaurant in the evening. Roberto likes to play sports. He plays soccer with his friends on weekends. He plays soccer with his friends on weekends. These people are Gerard and Sophie. These people are Gerard and Sophie. They live in Paris. They live in Paris. They like to eat French food. They like to eat French food. They are married. They are, they they are married. married. They have two children. They, they have, have two children. children. They speak French and Sophie speaks a little German. They speak French. Gerard and Sophie work in a hospital. Gerard and Sophie work in a hospital. They study English at night because they want to take a vacation in the US. Good. So listen, listen, and listen. Okay, let's do it individually. Vamos a hacerlo individualmente. Cada uno voy a llamar por su por su nombre y van a leer un párrafo. Son tres, así que una persona lee un párrafo, el siguiente el sí, el segundo. <coughs> Y el siguiente, el tercer párrafo. Y luego comenzamos otra vez y continuamos, ¿de acuerdo? Yes. Good. Erika Isabela. 
El primero, teacher. Yes. This is my friend. This is Ojuki. She lives in Tokyo. She has two brothers and one sister. Ojuki speaks English, French, and of course, Japanese. She studies medicine at the University of Tokyo. She wants to be a doctor. Ojuki likes to read newspaper and make. She reads the Ashaki Shin every day. This is how she likes to know about even in Japan. Romina, can you go with the next one? Yes, this is Robert. He lives in Iran. He has a big family, four brothers and three sisters. Robert speaks Italian and Spanish. He is the drama in the morning in the morning because he wants to be an actor. He works as a restaurant in the evening. Robert likes to play sport. He plays soccer with his friends on weekends. Naomi. These people are good, Gerard and Sophie. They love Paris. They like to eat fresh food. They are married. They have two children. They speak French and Sophie speak a little German. Gerard and Sophie work in a hospital. They study the English and ethnic because they want to take a vacation in the US. Thank you, Naomi. Argentina, begin again, please. Comienza de nuevo. This, this is Oyuki. She lives in, in Tokyo. She has two, two brothers and one sister. Oyuki speak, eh, speaks French and of course Japanese. She studies medicine at the University of Tokyo. She wants to be a doctor. Oyuki likes to read newspaper and magazines. She reads she read the Asa, Asashi Asai Shimbun every day because teacher volvió a salir esa like, because she likes to know about events in Japan. I'm sorry, I have the phone apagado. My dad, please read Roberto. Yes, Romy. This is Roberto. I live in room. He has big family. His four brothers and their sister Roberto speak Italian and Spanish. He has to this drum in the morning. He wants to be an actor. He works at restaurant in the heaven. Roberto likes to play sports. He plays soccer with his friend on weekends. Esperanza, can you read Gerard and Sophie? ¿Qué? ¿Leo el texto? Yes. Ah. Ger Gerard and Sophie. Ah, these two 
grupo A ya han sofrido. They lie in Paris. They like to get French food. They are married. They have two children. They speak French and Sophie speaks in a little German. Gerard and Sophie were in the hospital. They study English, but in the cells they want to take a vacation in U.S. U.S. is the United States. In the U.S. U.S. In the U.S. Very good, Esperanza. Thank you. Let's begin again. Let's go with Aranza. Yes. Aranza or Yuki. Escucha, teacher. Yes. My friend, this is Oyuki. She lives in Tokyo. She has two brothers and one sister. Oyuki speaks English, French, and of course, Japanese. She studies medicine at the University of Tokyo. She wants to be a doctor. Oyuki likes to read newspaper and magazine. She reads and the Asai Shimbo ever die because she likes to know about events in Japan. Isaia Alejandro, can you read Roberto? This is Roberto. He lives in Rome. He has a big family, four brothers and three sisters. Roberto speaks Italian and Spanish. He has students drunk in the morning. He has the ones to be an actor. He works at a restaurant in the evening. Roberto likes to play sports. He plays soccer with his friends on weekends. Good, thank you. Gustavo, Gerard and Sophie. He opened and shopping. He likes a place in Paris. He likes um, old and French home. They are married. They have two children. He speaks French and shopping. He still likes them all. They are a shopping for in hospital. They speak English and they welcome. They watch a dog package in the news. Good. Thank you, Gustavo. Let's go now with Eric Valentino Oyuki. This is Oyuki. She lives in Tokyo. She has two brothers and one sister. Oyuki speaks English, French, and of course, Japanese. She studies medicine at the University of Tokyo. She wants to be a doctor. Oyuki likes to read newspaper and magazine. She reads the Ahashi Shimbun every day because she likes to know a good events in Japan. Thank you. Leonel, can you read Roberto? Leo, tu audio no es muy bueno. Está bien, está bien. Puedes apagar el micrófono. Alexander, can you read Roberto? ¿Qué pasó, teacher? Can you read Roberto? Leo de Roberto. Yes, please. This is Roberto. He lives in Rome. He has a bad family, four brothers and three sisters. Roberto speaks Italian and Spanish. He studies drama in the morning because he wants to be an actor. He works at a restaurant in the evening. Roberto likes to play sports. He plays soccer with his friends on weekends. Very good, Alexander. Ahora todos escuchen, presten atención. Todos cometieron una serie de equivocaciones. 
no pasa nada, todavía estamos aprendiendo. El verso es un texto muy amplio para ustedes. Sin embargo, lo esencial, lo esencial es que presten atención a los verbos. Miren aquí. ¿Qué dice aquí? ¿Lift o lips? Lips. Lips. Que suene la S. Aquí que dice speak o speaks. Speaks. Que pronuncien la S. Speak. Y que dice study or studies. Studies. Y que dice new paper o newspapers. News, news, papers. News, papers. Magazine or magazines? Magazines. Want to be or wants to be? Want to be. Beef or lips? Lips. 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 Work or works? One. Like to play or likes to play? Like to play. Ahora presten atención aquí. Leaf or lips? Lips. Likes or like? Like. Has or half? Has. Speak or speaks? Speak. Works or work? Work. Okay. Entonces quiero que chequen algo rápidamente. ¿Quién es el sujeto aquí? O también podemos decir. Sí. ¿Y cuál es el sujeto? ¿O qué podemos decir? Sí. En el caso de la parejita, ¿quiénes son los sujetos? Gerard y Sophie. Gerard y Sophie. ¿Cuántas personas? Dos. ¿Qué podemos decir? Gerard y Sophie. ¿O? Entonces presten atención. Cuando se trate de he o she, el verbo se le va a poner as lips, studies, speaks. Likes to, wants to, pero cuando se trate de personas plurales, or I or you, el verbo es simple, live. Ok. Homework, presten atención. Homework, van a ver el video de la clase y lo van a escuchar muchas veces y me van a enviar un audio leyendo este texto. Ya lo tienen en su cuaderno, lo tienen en el video, ahora lo van a escuchar muchas veces, lo van a escuchar muchas veces y van a grabar un audio en el cual lo lean. No importa que lo entiendan. Importa que lo lean y que suene todo correcto. Ese es el objetivo de esta actividad. Así que presten atención. My friends, this is Oyuki. She lives in Tokyo. She has two brothers and one sister. Oyuki speaks English, French, and of course, Japanese. She studies medicine at the University of Tokyo. She wants to be a doctor. Oyuki likes to read newspapers and magazines. She reads the Asahi Shimbun every day because she likes to know about events in Japan. This is Roberto. He lives in Rome. He has a big family, four brothers and three sisters. Roberto speaks Italian and Spanish. He studies drama in the morning because he wants to be an actor. He works at a restaurant in the evening. Roberto likes to play sports. He plays soccer with his friends on weekends. These people are Gerard and Sophie. They live in Paris. They like to eat French food. They are married. They have two children. They speak French and Sophie speaks a little German. Gerard and Sophie work in a hospital. They study English at night because they want to take a vacation in the U.S. Entonces... Homework, tarea. Miren el video de la clase, practiquen y me envían el audio antes de el lunes. ¿Ok? Good. Okay.
Y la persona que tiene evaluación, cuando termine la sesión, que se conecte el encuentro, ¿de acuerdo? Yes. Good. See you next class. I see you. See you next class. Yes. Todo el texto.